going on, guys? Man, man, what's up, man? This is Professor Mitch here, man. Again, bringing you another fabulous motivational speech, man. Man, I had to do a part two on this thing, man. I had to do a part two, man. There, there's no way I could turn this thing down. I was going to let it go, but then, I, then, I, then it dawned on me. I said, man, who can really control time? No one can really can control time, man. You know I'm saying time is the most valuable commodity that we have on the universe. Time doesn't stop for anyone, no matter how much money you have, how wealthy you are, how wealthy and healthy you are, or anything like that, man. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Man, look, man, if you ain't got no haters on you, man, you're doing something wrong. But anyway, man. Man, this thing is about, man, just haters, man. This thing is about haters, man. Somebody is going to tell you something, you know what I'm saying, that you can't do because the simple fact they upset about something that you are doing. You know what I'm saying? It, just, it doesn't make any sense at all. When you are in your body, they're in their body, and you, you make up the, your mind and you decide when you are to do some things, and they're going to make up their mind. They're going to decide when they're going to do some things. Like I said, guys, man, time waits on no one. You can go out there, you can be fulfilling your life, doing your thing, get hit by a car, you know what I'm saying, you have no regrets. You have no regrets. You could be doing your thing, doing nothing, go hit by a car, and then you have some regrets because you should have done all what you fulfilled your life to do. Man, I just got this interesting text about, um, you know some feedback about man this is not the time to um, be you know doing motivation this is not the time I mean look when is the time when is the time there is no time there's no time to wait that's the whole point that's the whole point I'm trying to make you guys walk around here like y'all got all the time in the world you don't have time time waits on no one guys time waits on no one Y'all better get it through your head. You better make it up your mind. You better make it. Look, I've already gone through two deaths. One with my dad, one with my mom. Look, am I sobbing over it? I was. I'm over it, man. Look, I gotta. I can't do nothing. They can't do nothing about it. I can't do nothing about that. But what's even sadder is I'm walking through life. I'm going through life. And I cannot fulfill my dreams and my destiny while I'm alive. And I'm walking around dead. That's what I'm trying to tell you. And you're going to sit up and tell me, oh, this is not the time. This, when, is, when is going to be the time? When is the time going to be right? You can't get positive in the positive times. You can't get positive in your negative times. When is the time? Folks, if you don't change your mindset, you don't change your attitude and get on track on some things and start switching it, you're going to always do, do, dwell in, in, in your pain, in your suffering. For many, many years, like I've done. Now I, hey, I'm sensitive to the to the loss. It's time to mourn. It's gonna be time to mourn. But when you get through mourning, you better assess and you better evaluate what all that person went through, and you want to make that person proud by stepping forth, fulfilling your destiny. That's what someone needs to be telling you. That's what somebody needs to be telling you. Not shut up, sit back, get in the back, don't be seen, don't make a don't 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 make a, a scene. I don't want to see you. Shut up for a couple of months or something. I don't I don't even know what they're telling you, man. But look, man, it was disturbing to me, man. I was like, man, I gotta say something about this. This is not making any sense. They this is the, if this is the mindset of people, then they hey man, that's not the point I was trying to make. I'm trying to inspire inspire people. I'm trying to motivate people and wake up some people. Now, I understand that I'm going to step on some toes and a lot of people are going to be feeling a certain way because they're feeling a certain way because that's how they are. Now, I'm not going to touch everybody. Now, now I, had, I, had, I, now I got some mentors and they're telling me, look, Mitch, you're not going to touch everybody, pick an audience and blah, blah, blah. blah. Look, look, man, it's, it, it has to be good. Let it begin. Because I'm ready to take it, man. This is my destiny. I found my path in life, man. That's motivating myself, motivating you, and whoever else is going to listen. That's what I'm talking about. So this is what this whole thing is all about. All about shaking them haters off, man. Shaking. Hey, y'all giving me contact. Y'all giving me. Y'all. Y'all giving. Y'all giving me all my material to write. Keep it up. Please send me some more negative stuff. Please talk to me. Please, please, please. Keep it up. Keep it up. 
that's how much further I'm gonna go. That's what you need to do. You gotta shake it off, and you gotta pick up the pieces, and you gotta go. If you're dealing with a bad relationship, you gotta shake it off, pick up the pieces, and you gotta go. If you didn't get that business deal, shake it off, pick up the pieces, and you gotta go. That's just what it's gonna have to be, guys, because look, you can't dwell on the past, it's already happened. It's already happened. If the people, if the person's past, moved on, is in the past, you didn't get it, the relationship didn't work out, the house didn't work out, the girlfriend didn't work out, the wife didn't work out, it didn't work out, move on! Stop the dwelling on it, keep them up, keep them, pick up the pieces and go. It's gonna be a time to mourn, and it's gonna be a time to move on. You gotta make up your mind, man. You just can't sit there. Get up and go and move. That's what I'm saying. It, all that crying is not gonna do anything for you. You need to figure out what it is that you need to do to move forward to make that person proud of you in life. Make that person proud. You gotta make that person proud. If I had opportunity to do it again all over, if I knew what I know now, I would've made my, my parents proud. Stop disappointing them. But now, I'm moving forward now. And somebody gonna come around and tell you what you should do and what you shouldn't do when you ought to do something. Don't listen to these naysayers, guys. They'll have you set back. They'll have you set back farther than what you know, man. You gotta, you gotta keep, keep on moving forth, man. You gotta keep on moving forth and keep striving and keep thriving. Feel your life, man. If you was on your deathbed, man, at one point, and a lot of people walking around here dead, even though they not dead, they walking around here dead. You better find a way to bring yourself back to life. Because I'm, I'm here to tell you, you will die in your negativity. You will die in that negativity. And not really fulfill your destiny. So you, hey man. Get it through your head, man. Get it through your, get it through your head, man. I'm so, I'm, so, I'm so mad right now, man. Get it through your head, man. You better change it right now. If you don't change it. You're gonna die right there where you stand, man. Hey, hey, you're gonna die right there. You better, hey, don't worry about what everybody's saying about you. Don't worry about what they're saying, what they're thinking, what he ought to do, what he, what he shouldn't do, and everything else. Don't get fixated that. Keep looking to the future and keep moving. This is Professor Mitch, man. Like, thumbs up, share, subscribe if this likes you, man. If you like it, whatever, man. I'm just trying to tell you, keep looking forward, man. Until next time, I'm out, man. Keep, keep, keep it up, man. Keep it up. Keep the negativity up, man. Keep it up. Keep giving me material. I like that. I'm out, man.